Welcome back. The latest Fox News poll shows Donald Trump leading in South Carolina, but Senator Ted Cruz also showing double-digit support. Cruz taking the lead in a recent poll of Iowa voters conducted by Monmouth University. Joining us now is the wife of the presidential candidate, Senator Ted Cruz. Heidi Cruz with us this morning to get a sense of what the campaign trail looks like from your standpoint. So nice to meet you, Heidi. Nice to meet you, Maria. Thank, Thank you so much for me. joining us. Yeah, no, we're happy you're here because, I'm, you know, when you're running for president, it's an all-in thing, I assume. It is. And uh, has it been all-encompassing for you? It is. It's been 100%. Um, and I, I took a leave of absence and I'm so glad that I did because uh, Ted and I do everything together. We're a partnership, we're a team, and I'm here 100% to support him, to do everything I can to help him win this election for our country. Um, he's done that so many times for me in my career, helping me win, and I'm really pleased to be able to give this to the campaign. Well, I love the fact that, that you, you took a leave of absence from your career because you have your own career and have been uh, involved and very independent for a long time. I've watched you every morning for many, many years. Oh, that's fantastic. <laughs> uh, but I've, I've very much enjoyed my career in the private sector, um, and it's really a wonderful thing in this country that we have the opportunity to run for office, to give back, and to um, run on our values. Uh, I believe that this country shares Ted's values, that Ted shares the values of this country. And, and I think his followers, that's the most important thing, actually, his values. And when you saw people become afraid and, and, and the level of terror and fear was rising in the country, you saw people looking toward Ted Cruz to, for, for solutions. And that's why he gained as much as he did just recently. I think so. Well, Ted spoke out about keeping Americans safe. And that will always be his number one priority, and keeping America's interests first. Let me, let me ask you about that, because I think in, in an environment where fear is as, as, as high as it is, that does certainly resonate. People are wondering if Ted Cruz can win the general election against Hillary Clinton. What does he need to do in order to have that uh, resonate, that people feel, yes, he is going to be my guy in the general election? Yes. Well, this is why um, I wanted to be 100% in on this campaign, because I believe that Ted will win the general election. Uh, I believe he'll be our nominee. I believe he is the Republican candidate, the best suited to beat Hillary Clinton. And the reason is because Ted understands the constitutional liberties that undergird our country. Um, he understands that we need to create jobs, growth, and economic opportunity for those graduating from college, for those at the bottom of the economic ladder, for those building businesses, and that that comes from the private sector. Uh, Ted's a Tenth Amendment guy. We need to reduce the size of the federal government and um, put power back to the states uh, and keep our economy strong. Ted also understands how to defend our constitutional liberties, and he will do that, as he's done long before he ever ran for office. And lastly, Ted wants to restore America's leadership position in the world, and I think this will make this country a much safer place. Now, is that why you're coming out and doing interviews, making sure people understand who he is as a, as a father, as the head of a household, because people want to see his family life? Absolutely. And um, there are some qualities about Ted that I learned very early on when we first met. We met on the George W. Bush campaign in 2000. We've been married 14 and a half years, have two little girls, Caroline is seven and Catherine's five. And there were a couple qualities that struck me immediately about Ted. And I'll tell you, I really um, fell in love with Ted immediately. We kind of had a, had a love at first sight romance. Uh, and I want Americans to know what the qualities were that made me fall in love with him. Uh, and the first is he's principled. This is a man who knows what he believed, what he believes. He memorized the constitution of the child, but not memorized it only, understood its meaning. Secondly, he is a person of great courage, and we've seen this in the Senate. We've seen it on many occasions. Um, he's incredibly articulate. He is unflappable. Uh, he's steady, and even at home, he's very laid back. Ted is very laid back and low-key. Principles and courage. Uh, obviously, yeah. that uh, resonates with, yes. with our viewers right this now. Guy. You can't rattle him. Um, the last thing is he's very thoughtful. Ted's uh, a romantic. He loves a Broadway play. He never misses date night. He always finds the occasion to bring flowers. Um, look at how a man treats his children, his wife, and his mother. Heidi, thanks for sharing that with us. Good to have you on the program today. Thank you, Maria. We'll be nice watching. Thanks so much. Okay. Heidi Cruz joining us. Stuart.